Protesters across the country are calling to defund the police, but one black conservative leadership network says that will only hurt the black, uh, the black community. Uh, that's according to One America's Stefan Kleinhens in Washington. As protests continue in major cities across the nation following the death of George Floyd, many are now calling on the government to defund the police. Derek Green is a fellow with Project 21, a leadership network for black conservatives. And he says defunding the police would in fact cause more harm to the black communities. Defund the police, I think conservatives can say we are against defunding the police because one, it's just simply impractical. But two, if we look at crime statistics and we know that the majority of crime is intra-racial, then what we're doing is if we're going to defund the police, what we're going to do is create more black victims of black criminality. And so we can't say that. So then again, that's another example in which conservatives of all colors can demonstrate that black lives matter in a different way. We don't want poor black people in underserved or under economically underserved areas who don't have the resources to move to different areas to be constant victims of, of, of criminality. So, but if we defund the police, that's exactly what's going to happen. Green says that he agrees black lives matter, but he disagrees with the premise of the movement. I agree that black lives matter. I simply disagree with your movement and your narrowly defined idea of how black lives ma matter, specifically blacks involved uh, in police encounters and police brutality. Statistically insignificant, though the people who have been killed are not insignificant. And I want to make that distinction. There are a lot of other ways that we can demonstrate that black lives matter. We can start going and encouraging blacks to get married, having children within wedlock, uh, advocating for blacks to speak up loudly so poor black children can have better education, having blacks speak up loudly to say we want to reduce economic regulation so we can employ more black people, particularly black males. Green says the current protests have lost their initial focus for justice and they will have lasting consequences on the nation. It started out in pursuit of justice, but it quickly metastasized to something a lot more violent uh, and destructive. And so I think that, uh, one, you can't pursue justice with acts of injustice because it, it undermines any kind of moral authority that the pursuit of justice has. Uh, but two, I think that it is it is increased the discord that was already there. Stefan Kleinhens, One American News, Washington.